Havana all over again? A U S Government employee in China is said to have a mild traumatic brain injury after experiencing subtle and vague, but abnormal, sensations of sound and pressure, causing the State Department to urge you. S. Citizens in China to report any symptoms or medical problems they notice while in the country. The employee works at the U. S. Consulate in the southeastern city of Guangzhou, CBS News reports. The U. S. Government is taking these reports seriously and has informed its official staff in China of this event, according to a State Department statement. We do not currently know what caused the reported symptoms and we are not aware of any similar situations in China, either inside or outside of the diplomatic community. The symptoms are reminiscent of the mysterious health attacks on you. S. And Canadian diplomatic staff in Cuba, which have stumped doctors and left the staffers with hearing loss and brain damage. Desert Facility, according to a report in the New York Times. A team of California-based weapons researchers believes it has stumbled across evidence of a secret facility operating in the remote Iranian desert. Researchers at the International Institute for Strategic Studies said work on the site is often carried out under cover of night and focuses on rocket engines and rocket fuel. They say their analysis of structures and ground markings at the facility strongly suggest that it's developing the technology for long-range missiles. The investigation highlights some potentially disturbing developments, said Michael Elliman, a missile researcher who reviewed the material, adding that it could the first steps for developing an ICBM 5 to 10 years down the road. The press officer at Iran's United Nations mission declined to comment on the findings.